Hi everybody, welcome back to the Native Family. If you are new here, welcome. Feel free to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you are returning. Hey family, I have an awesome 99 cent store haul for you guys. I found some new name brand items and some cute decor. So I'm going to go ahead and get started and show you what I got so I can get everything put away. I have a super busy day ahead of me. So tonight we are going to be doing a movie night with the kids and I told them that we can do something different. So we decided to do finger foods for dinner tonight. Um, this is not a new product at the 99, but it is an awesome product at the 99. It's $3.99 for the Frank's Red Hot Wings. This is in Kick and Barbecue. This is super good, guys. Kids absolutely love it. Put it in the air fryer and you're good to go. I also have a bag that I'm going to be doing my own marinade with to make Asian wings with. They also have the Market Pantry Crispy Straight Cut French Fries. This is a Target brand. Awesome price for 99 cents because at Target they range, from, range around $2.99, $2.50 sometimes if they're on sale. And this is two pounds of fries, so that's going to go with the finger food items we're doing for our movie night. Then I didn't even know the Pioneer Woman had a frozen meal line, but apparently she does because I found it today. This is the toasted sausage ravioli with marinara. Looks super good. We're also going to put this in the air fryer and give it a try. Picked up two boxes because it had a really good expiration date of July 3rd of 2020. So we will use one box for our finger food night and have one for a snack for another day. Also, they've been having a lot of bread on markdowns at my store lately. I always buy English muffins. If you guys are new to the channel, I do make my own egg McMuffins on the weekends instead of going to McDonald's. Plus, the kids do like to eat these in the morning before school. So, they sell the 10 packs now for $1.99. They used to have the 6 packs for $0.99, cents, but I still paid $0.99 because it was half off. So, that was a really good deal. I do have soup on the menu. I'm going to be making a beef and vegetable soup. And I came across these Bolt House Farm rainbow carrots. These look super yummy. I love how vibrant the colors are. So, I think that will be an awesome addition to our soup. I think that's all the food items. I'm going to go ahead and get into the skincare items that I came across. Both of my girls suffer from eczema. They have since they were little. So when I saw the St. Ives Soothing Sheet Mask, that's oatmeal, I did pick up. I thought I picked up four, but I picked up three. I need to pick up one more. For $1.49, I picked it up because stuff like this is a lot more expensive. Definitely $3.99 and up. I, I've seen it before. So this is a very good name brand product. Super excited to find that. Then they have the Maybelline Define a Brow. This is one of my favorite items I have ever found from the 99 cent store. They carry it every once in a while and when I do come across it, I stock up because there, there's three of us girls in the house and each one of us wear makeup and we all wear the same color. So fortunately, I picked up six, two for each of us to have and easily this would be $6.99 in the store. So I got six pretty much for the price of one. Can't pass that up. Super good deal. Then growing up, I always used Noxzema. That was my skincare regimen as a kid, or just soap and water. But Noxzema was my ultimate favorite, and it came in the tub. I'm pretty sure it still comes in the tub, but today I came across it in the tube at the 99 cent store, so I was so happy. Four of them for four bucks. Super cool deal. And this is the original, so I'm going to give each girl one to have, and I'm gonna keep two in, well, one for me and one in the stockpile. I was thinking, because with it being in a tube, it'd be perfect for them to take and put in their PE locker so they can wash their face after PE. Then this is another item we actually do buy at a big box store. We usually pick this up at Walmart, and the four pack is like $4.49, something like that. And I got an eight pack today for $3.99, so that was definitely a good deal. This is the Johnson Foot Soak. It's borax, iodine, and brand. This is so good for your feet. When you're done soaking your feet, they are so soft. And we just got over having, you know, sandal weather, chunkla weather, and it's time to get our feet all back the way they need to be. That was it as far as all those goodies now into the decor. I know we just got over the whole Halloween, but they do have their Christmas items out. And there's one thing that I've learned from shopping at the 99 cent store and even the Dollar Tree is if they come out with something that you know is going to be super popular and you like it, you need to pick it up when you find it because chances are when you go back, it's not going to be there. So I have been picking up a few things here and there that I want to add to the decorations I already have. So they have these really cute Merry Christmas um, kickstand sign. This one has the little old station wagon on it. I really, really love that. It reminds me of the movie A Christmas Story. 
But I'm going to tell you guys, be careful with the ones you pick out because Merry and Christmas on this one, they are written out in glitter. I'm going to have to do a little repairing of the writing if I decide to keep them this way. I also have the Farm Fresh Christmas with uh, tree with the truck. I want to take, I might take this one because I have a lot of the truck stuff already. I want to make a kickstand for my coffee bar. So I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it the way it is or if I'm going to jazz it up a little bit for what I need it for. But these were only 99 cents and I thought they were going to be more, but they weren't. So I was happy when I came across those. Also for my coffee bar, I picked up this cute, he's so adorable, snowman spoon rest. I love this top hat. It's one of my favorite holiday decorations. A lot of people like the whole stocking hat. I love the top hat. It just seems very retro to me when I see a top hat. So he was super cute and he was also only 99 cents. Then they have this beautiful sleigh. They also have it in red, but I chose to get the white one. It has the beautiful foliage in it with the little holly berries and the pine cones with this cute little bow. I'm going to be putting that in my coffee bar too. And this was only 99 cents. I'm telling you, their prices are pretty good. They, they have gone up on some things, but this for 99 cents, I still think that's a great deal, you know? Then as far as ribbon, they had two kinds of ribbons that I picked up. I did not pick up the truck ribbon. I was going to, I thought about it and I was like, I don't want too much of the red truck. I don't want an overkill. A lot of my decoration is very rustic and cabin, those kind of decorations. So when I came across this one with the burlap, with the buffalo check and the cutouts, I thought this was adorable. And I do want to make a bow topper for my tree this year. So this has the Christmas tree, the bear, sorry about the glare guys, and the tree. So I picked up two of those. That is going to be super fun. And I also picked it up in the red buffalo check. I picked up two of those. Because if you guys have watched my other hauls, I am going to try to teach the girls how to make wreaths and other decorations this year. So to go with that kind of idea, idea I can't speak today, guys. I'm sorry. I'm still still recovering from being sick. Thank you for all of you guys, you know, bearing with me, even though my voice is raspy and I can't breathe right. And you guys have been awesome through this whole process. So back to these, there are 15 pieces and these were only 99 cents. I was super happy. Back when I lived more towards the um, mountains, we would go and pick our own pine cones and then paint them. I actually have a box that the girls have done since they were little, but I needed ones that were a little more flat to do for the wreath. And I also want to make fillers for my tree because I don't have that great big of a tree. So I wanted to make a little fuller. So I picked up two of those guys and like I said, 99 cents each. Then I came across these placemats, and when I came across these placemats, I fell in love with them. I love the way the trees look. The writing is absolutely beautiful, and I love the stripes. I love anything with stripes on it. They were $1.49, and I did pick up two of them, because what I want to do is I want to make little throw pillows with them, and this is what the back looks like. So I just want, I, I might have to either find a placemat this size or I might have to go into Joann's and just get, you know, either the red or the green. I'm not sure if I'll, I might do a green backing, maybe a one green, one red, but I do own a sewing machine. So I'm going to make these into pillows. And if I think they're cute, I'll go back and get more because for $1.49, super inexpensive. And those would make really good gifts on a budget. Then they have these really awesome galvanized steel chargers. This one says Believe. It also came in um, Seasons Greetings or something, or Happy Holidays. Happy Holidays, I think it is. If you guys follow me on Instagram, I do post a lot of pictures of the things I don't purchase. But I chose to get the Believe. I'm going to be picking up the plate displays that they have at Dollar Tree. Because I thought I had some and I don't. And okay, heads up on this. It rang up $1.99, even though it says $1.49. So if you do pick these up, pay attention to the register when you are ringing them up. They just fixed it for me. They were really awesome about it. Then the red truck, guys. Yes, it's everywhere. But I found this awesome tray, and it says Season Greetings, and it has the beautiful red truck on it with the Christmas tree and the nice plaid outline. It's so cute. It's a little flimsy, guys, but it was only 99 cents, and I'm not going to be using it to hold cookies or anything. It's just going to be put up on a plate display and put like that in the kitchen. So this was my favorite thing as far as decor I have probably ever picked up. I fell in love with this guy. It did have another one. They had a basset hound and he was equally cute. He didn't have the top hat. He had like the little stocking hat on, but I absolutely love French bulldogs. 
And when I saw this cookie jar, I was like, oh my gosh, it has the top hat with a little holly. And look, he's got a little red scarf on and he has a little striped sweater on and look at his little tail even. This is such a detailed cookie jar. And he was only $5.99, but I did fall in love with him. I, part of me still wants to go back and get the Basset Hound so I can have the set, but I told myself to pick the one I like the most and I absolutely love him. Look at his eyes. So very beautiful thing that I came across in the 99. You know, set up your coffee bar or your hot chocolate bar, or even if you do a little buffet, no one's gonna know that you've got all these ornaments, you know, at the 99 cent store. That's what I love about being able to bargain shop. So this is my haul, guys. If you like these kind of videos, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification bell if you wanna be notified of when we upload new videos. And as always, family, don't forget to be kind, inspire, be inspired, and I will see you next video. Bye.